Hi, my name is Penny and this is Penny's Crafts Creations. I am hoping to share with you um, what I create throughout my videos and maybe we can learn together. You can give me some tips and tricks that you use differently than I would. So today I'm going to show you how to make this flower. It is a sunflower for my sunflower journal that I am creating and I got the inspiration from this paper that I picked up on a trip to Hobby Lobby. So you're going to need um, to punch out three shapes of the flower of your choice. I chose this one. I call it my poinsettia flower because it reminds me of poinsettias and I use it a lot during the holiday season for that and three of the shapes and I went ahead and crimped them to give them more texture and you're going to need three different colors. I went ahead and did this one already and started this one and you just need to use the tips only and I just slide it across the rubber stamp and the reason you just need to do the tips is because that's the only part that's going to show on most of the flower. Um, on the top one you want to do the, the whole thing and the texturing from the crimping also gives the flower more di dimension on the top and I go ahead and I saturate the tips with the ink only because you really want to give that accent in more dimension. So you're just lightly brushing them and that's it. I'll set the inks aside. And then I'm going to use the, the ball end of this um, flower press. And I'm just going to go around the outside of the flower petals just to give it more dimension and I'm going to do that with all three of them and I've been watching YouTube for a very long time I've just never had the courage to do a video until now and I figured I can learn from other people maybe some people can learn something that they didn't know from me and I'm always um, doing different types of crafting I love to sew and paper craft, paint, I do jewelry. I'm kind of like a hodgepodge crafter. I do a little bit of everything. So then you decide what you bought on the bottom petal is going to be. I'm going to go with green because it's like leaves. So we're going to do just a dab of hot glue in the middle. And then the next one is going to be the orange. And you're going to off center it just a little bit. Just enough to give it a little bit of dimension there another dab of hot glue and then a trick um, when you're applying your hot glue on paper rub the tip of it on the paper and you won't get those little pesky strings and then off center that one so I'm gonna go with this and it has a pearl in the center and it's flat on the back side so I'm just gonna take my hot glue and put it on there and again, I'm going to rub it along the side to get rid of those strings and just kind of center it in the middle. And there you go. And that this kind of makes it look like it's more sparkly than it really is, but it is got holes on the outside. So that's it. You can add um, another paper if you'd like to um, give it more dimension by in as long as you off center them you'll be able to see that little piece there so that's it that's my intro video um, thanks for watching and I hope we can learn together some more have a great day